under fire, under investigation, and now under review by a grand jury. A grand jury has been appointed and is now looking at a possible criminal act by Hartford's mayor. Fox 61's Lori Perez has got an exclusive interview with the mayor tonight. She joins us live with his reaction. This is the latest in what has been an ongoing state probe, an almost year-long probe, into some of Mayor Eddie Perez's actions while in office. A grand jury is a big deal, but the mayor has remained confident throughout the investigation and remains so even now. I welcome the uh, uh, one-man grand jury. The mayor is holding strong tonight, insisting he sees the chief state's attorney's appointment of a grand jury as another step toward ending the probe into his administration. As long as we have a timely end to the investigation, which is, uh, I think, his goal, I, I think we're doing the right thing. Of course, he's counting on the end to be favorable to him. Charges of cronyism surfaced last April when it was revealed that the mayor had awarded a no-bid contract for this downtown parking lot to a former state rep and member of the city's Democratic Town Committee. At that time, the mayor told us a bidding process wasn't required because it was a short-term license, but he nonetheless handed it over to the Hartford Parking Authority. And people ask me to reconsider that. I've reconsidered it. Then, in August, criminal investigators searched the mayor's home, investigating work done there by a contractor friend who has also done millions of dollars of work for the city. The mayor admitted using the contractor was a mistake, but insisted it was on the up and up. The work that was done in my house was fully paid for. Even with the state probe, the mayor was, of course, recently re-elected. He says the grand jury will confirm what he's been saying all along. I know what I've done. I've disclosed what I've done. I've shared that. This was an issue during the election, and uh, it has to come to a conclusion. Uh, everything happened before the election, I think people knew, and we're moving the city forward. Now, some call this kind of continuing confidence from the mayor really bravado. Now, a few words about what exactly the grand jury is and can do. The state investigatory grand jury is a one-person jury. It's made up of one judge who can compel testimony and gather evidence. It does not have the power to charge, indict, or otherwise accuse a person of a crime. And we will be watching in the weeks to come to see who will be subpoenaed. I'm Lori Perez, Fox 61 News at 10.